So I got a vase today. I'm gonna be vasing with show. You guys know her from my videos. Um, I don't know. Oh, there she is right now. In the GT2 RS, Marcus. You got a nice cool vest. C8. That's pretty brand new to me. Yeah. American Muscle. What's up? You came here to beat me? Yeah. Wait, is it tuned? Yeah. How, how much horsepower does it have? Really? She's pushing 600? She oh, wow. Wait, I want to hear it. You have? All right, all right. Hey, my guess. How much horsepower is it? 600. 600? But she weighs like 80 pounds, so she might beat me. <laughs> wow, power to weight, and you don't know how much she's actually practiced with this car. Jeez. Has she drag raced before? We actually don't know anything. It's mysterious, so it's about to be interesting. Maybe she's a low-key race driver. You never know, Marcus. You nervous, bro? You nervous? Yeah, I'm nervous. Yeah, technically power to weight. It should be close. Marcus gained a couple pounds, so. <laughs> <laughs> hey, shout out to all the female race car drivers out there. I mean, they're killing it. So maybe Michelle might have a surprise under her hood. We'll see. We'll see. Let's ask the audience and see who thinks they will win. I mean, that thing is no joke. Mm -hmm. That is a bumblebee. It's gonna fly. <laughs> it stings and puts the power down too. Well, we know Marcus is a good driver. He's raced many times. Michelle, this is mysterious, so we're gonna have to see what happens. Power to rate really means everything, as well as sticking the tires onto the ground, guys. So make sure your tires are warm. Marks, you already know what to do. And but, hey, one thing, make sure you don't let her win, all right? All right. <laughs> we'll flag it down, bro. You got this. Let's go. Don't right? miss your shift. Don't miss your shift, or you are gonna lose. Make sure you guys like and subscribe and turn on our notifications. Still break cars. It's just gonna get crazier. How you feeling, Michelle? You think you're gonna win? Yeah, I feel pretty confident. You know whoever loses buys dinner tonight, right? Yeah, that's okay with me. <laughs> Alright. Alright, Marcus. Sounds like she's trying to make you buy dinner tonight. Alright, good luck. Hey, knowing Marcus, even if he loses, he's still gonna buy dinner. Or if he wins, it doesn't matter. Nah, I'm not buying. <laughs> 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 Same I guess. Alright. Yo, yeah, who do you know. think is gonna win? I mean, obviously, if you like the Porsche, you're gonna take this. But I mean, girl power, maybe the C8 might take it. She said it's two and 600. Oh, see? Exactly right now. Yeah. Hey, she might, she might get him, you know? He might get distracted by her beauty or something. You never know. Whoever loses buys dinner, so I guess we'll see. All right, let's go. I'm kind of nervous, but... Hey, good luck out there. Good luck, Michelle. You got him. Nah. She about to whoop you, boy. All right, are you calling it? Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and call this. We got the Corvette. Lucas is going to hop in the car with Michelle. We got the Porsche GT2 RS. Cyrus is going to be going in the car with Marcus. Um... This thing has a quick launch. The Corvette has a quick launch. Super light, both cars. It's gonna be an interesting race. I'm gonna let them know that I'm gonna point to each driver, put my arms up, and then when both arms reach down, that means go. So let's go ahead and tell both drivers, all right? All right, Marcus already knows the deal about ready, set, go. So we'll go ahead and tell Michelle. All right, Michelle, so I'm gonna point at Marcus. He's gonna do his launch control. And then when I point at you, do your launch control. I'm gonna put both arms up, and then when I go down, that means go. Okay, so when both arms go down, take your foot off the brake and go. Okay. Alright, any questions? She's ready. She's, She's ready? She's ready. Alright, cool. It's gonna be an interesting one, guys. Let's see who gets some free dinner tonight. Horsepower kicked in, so that was a good race. Was that fun? Yeah, that was fun. I was nervous, but it was fun. <laughs> yeah. Bro, I'm getting distracted out here. That was a good race, though. Focus, focus. Let's no go. Excuse. All right, we're gonna go to 20 miles per hour. When I say go, you go. I'm gonna count to three and then say go, okay? So, one, two, three, go! One, two, three, go! Yeah. Want to, but she probably has NOS in there. I don't know, but it's like you.
you take off, then she catches up a little bit, and then you ended up taking it at the end. So, Dude. you want to try one more race? Yeah. All right, let's do it. So I guess now we're going to do another launch race. So maybe this time we'll get a better chance. How was that? It's pretty quick. I don't know how much horsepower it has. What do you think? Well, I think it's around 600 or something, 650 maybe. How close was it? I can't really tell from back here. I think she has knots. Shut up, no ah, way. Yeah. Yo, Marcus is accusing her of having knots, man. Nah, it was pretty close though, but the push, this horsepower is gonna kick let's go in. Again. Let's go again, let's go again. Let's do another launch. All right, we ready again? Yep. All right, let's do let's it. I'm not gonna lie, Michelle took off a little bit late that time. Yeah. When my hands went down, she took off just a little bit late. So Marcus got the jump on that race just by a little bit. I would say like half a second. I mean, hey, same results. I think if she would have taken off a little bit earlier, right when my hands went down, the race would have been a lot closer, but she's doing an amazing job. I think this might be her first race too, so. Going up against a GT2 RS, dude, that, that car is no joke. The fact that the Corvette is performing this well, it's, it's shocking. The Corvette was keeping up with Marcus. That's definitely pushing around 600 something horsepower. It's a light car, so I'm not surprised there. We're gonna do one more roll race and see what happens. Let's do it, Marcus. All right, now we're gonna do the second rolling race. One, two, three, go! Good job, you did awesome. Thank That's you. fun. Yeah. Good race. Still close, Marcus. Man, she might come back with some more horsepower. You might lose on the next race. I don't know. Yeah, that, was, that was fun, bro. I'm having fun. How was it? It was good. It was a lot closer, but obviously, we'll talk about the results when we get out. Look at Marcus opening the door for her, look. <laughs> it's a gentleman, you feel me? <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Alright, even though I won, I still got you. I, uh, I told you. Yeah, yeah. Sai, you, Sai, you called it. Sai, you called My bro's it. bro's a gentleman. It's crazy how cars can just hide their horsepower, guys. Maybe next time, she'll put in some more horsepower beach on the next race, Marcus. Watch out. Yeah, so the C8 took off on launch, but when the Porsche's horsepower kicked in, it just took over, so the Porsche won. That was a good race. I think we're all surprised at how quick the Corvette was off the line. That thing is incredible. On this last race, Michelle did take off just a little late, and she still managed to keep up with the Porsche, which was insane. So Corvette, bang for your buck. I mean, Porsche, obviously, ultimate performing car. Great job to both racers. You guys killed it. You guys killed it. Don't forget to like and subscribe and watch our last video. Love you guys. Yeah. Hey, Faster lifestyle. Let's go. Peace.